Hello everyone, in this video we are going to discuss about the one of the most confusing word that is upstream and downstream means. So what is the meaning of upstream and downstream in the oil and gas industry, in refinery, fertilizer industry, in petrochemical industry, in chemical industry that we are going to discuss in this video. If you deal with the PNIDs, if you deal with the PFD, if you deal with the plant, okay, if you are working in a plant then you must know about the, these two words because I have seen that many times let's suppose the senior say that please do that or they they use in that phrase they use the upstream and downstream words so sometimes I have seen that the newcomers confuse okay so what is the meaning of the upstream let's discuss about it okay so here you will see that I'll take the example of the upstream here okay for that I'll take the one reference that is the P001 this is the pump okay please let me in the comments box what is the like which type of the pump is this this is the PNID symbol of the pump so please let me in the comments box which type of the pump is this okay so here you will see that there is the my tank T001 then this is the N3 nozzle okay and from where this is the suction line of the pump okay there the one wall is one wall is there this is the butterfly type wall okay the pnid symbol of the butterfly wall is like that now this is the your pump okay and in the discharge line you will see here there is the one line that is connected to the safety wall okay let's suppose whenever the discharge pressure will increase so this psv will pop up at six bar g right then this is your PG that is the pressure gauge or the local indicator okay and this is the tag number of this PG then this is the your dampener and after that again there is the butterfly wall okay this is the this is your discharge line okay and I am taking here this pump I am taking as a reference I am taking as a reference right so now what is the meaning of the upstream okay let's suppose if you are working in a DCS okay you are operating the DCS or you are operating the plant with the help of the DCS and you say to the operator that please go in the vacuum section and close the upstream wall of the P001 so what is the meaning of it which wall that operator has to close so he has to close the this wall okay because this is the upstream wall of the P001 I hope you are getting my point what I want to say right if you will take the P001 is a reference then this is your upstream wall right and this wall is also the upstream wall so here you will have to clarify that which wall that which wall that operator has to close means the butterfly wall or the ball wall okay but this is the drain wall as well so simply you can say the drain wall please close the please close the or please open the the drain wall of T001 or you can say please close the or open the upstream wall of the P001 or the suction wall of the P001 right are you getting my point what I want to say this is very very important now this is the I hope you got my point that what is the meaning of the upstream now, now let's suppose if someone that is new to the plant okay let's suppose if I have to find out the T002 that is the tank T002 so what I can say simply I can say that the T00 the T002 is the upstream of T001 means this tank will come before the T001 same here if, if I say so same I can say here means this is the pump and this was my reference right so this wall comes before the this wall comes before the this pump that's why this is the upstream right now you can take the let's suppose T001 you can take the reference and from there you can understand that okay this will be the upstream this will be the upstream are you getting my point what I want to say okay now what will be the downstream means yes you are saying right the downstream means let's suppose this is your one pump okay then this damper wall this pg this safety wall this uh, butterfly wall will be the downstream okay let's suppose if i say to you that please check it out that whether this psv is pop up or not so what i can say let's suppose this psv number is psv 165 
so what i'll say i'll simply say that please go to the vacuum section and check it out that whether the downstream the downstream psv of the p001 is pop up or not or please check it out the heading of the downstream pg of the p001 so this is the downstream pg this is the down this is the downstream damper wall of the p001 this is the downstream butterfly wall of the p001 right so that you have to keep in mind because this point is very very important whenever we are dealing with the pnid whenever we are working in a plant that i have mainly seen in the industry so when i was in the fertilizer plant so mainly when i was the newcomer so i have seen that the operators talk about the upstream and downstream please go there and there is the wall that is the upstream of that control wall so i mainly confused okay but when i understood about it so then i got to know that ki what is the meaning of the upstream and downstream and that is the mainly used in the like in the meeting as well or in the hajop in the normal convey whenever like you discuss whenever you are in the let's suppose in the dcs there is the dcs operator and you are in the plant so that word that phrase is mainly used please close the that upstream wall or downstream wall so you must know about it okay so there is the one pnid okay this is one pnid and this is the control wall so please let me in the comments box what will be the upstream and downstream of the this control wall right so this is the question for you all so i hope that you got to know about the upstream and downstream means if you have any doubt in this video please please let me in the comments box and if you comments so it gives us the motivation that to make more videos about the industrial engineering about the about the instrumentation about the process engineering okay so please let me in the comments box so that's all for the today's video thanks for watching till then keep learning